Hello, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Today I am going to be doing a closure wig, which I've never done before, but I'm going to try it and let's get into the video. So I had bought this wig from AliExpress. Cranberry. This is how it looks. I never put it on yet, so I wanted to record. It's like a bob or something. Oh, I think it's going to be really pretty. It's a closure. Okay. And this is the cap I got. Hope it works. Blend in. And I have braided my hair down. A little sloppy, but it's freshly washed. My husband, I have recorded my husband doing my hair. So if you missed that video, if you haven't seen it, I will link it down in the description box. So you can look at it. Okay. Look what color this is. Let's see. I have my mirror over here if you see me looking. I'm just going to ball my hair in the back. Mind you, I am not a professional wig person. Because I don't wear wigs like that. Anyway, I'll wear my red hair. Okay. I'm going to try this wig on to see how it looks first. So it would be get rid of comb and uh, try to part it. Where would I want my part? I want to try down the middle. I think that would be cute. <gasps> A cute bob. Why does it look like that? You can see, like, but well, that's the wig. So, oh, wow, that looks pretty good. Yeah, I ain't even put no glue. I might not even use glue because I just need a little touch up. Oh, not even ready. I just need a little touch up. Uh. <laughs> and I ain't even do it for real. Alright, now I'm gonna cut this lace off. I'm gonna cut this lace off. Yeah, I think I'm onto something now. These clothes are wigs because the full lace wigs, it makes me break out if I keep it on like longer than a day on my forehead. I guess because of the adhesive, and plus I have like really oily skin, so that won't work out at all. I don't know how much lace should I cut off. Should I cut off some more? Maybe a tad bit more. Let me cut this off and I'll be right back. Okay, so I'm back and I did cut some off, if you could tell. So, to be honest, I don't even think I need, um, I don't even think I need, like, got to be glue or anything because it fit pretty snug already so it's tight i'm gonna part it i think i went down the middle like this yeah this is my first time getting a bob that blend in with my skin mm, it's really tight okay it's like pulling or something that's my wig cap Cause my wig cap is new, so it's like, mm. Ugh, I don't want that though. I feel like it's pulling on my edges. I'm not gonna pull my wig cap that far up, cause that that hurts. Okay. 
Yeah, I don't see how people. Oh. It's like you give me a face. Alright. So I'm gonna party in the middle. Well, look at that wig get way back there. Okay. I don't know what I'm doing. I wanna loosen this wig a tad bit because it's just just pull them oh, that's so much better all right let's try this again let's try this again okay yo how do people wear wigs every day because even though it's a closure i am like struggling y'all i might do need some do need to put some glue, but I, don't, I really don't feel like it. And I cannot get this part straight. It's so hard. Like, it's crooked. This is how you know. I am really not a weak whale. All right. So, I got some. This is aloe vera juice that I want to use to spread my wig. I'm washing it in. See if I need to put some glue because I really don't feel like doing no glue. I would love to just, just wear it. Like, you know. So I'm going to put this in the section and do this other side. Oh, it's lit there. But I understand people who wear wigs because it's so like convenient like you know how to do your hair it's like a protective style in a way I guess <coughs> I need to get this dripping wet because I want that um that curly wet look so I need to get it wet oh yeah it's cute I'm feeling this. Okay, let's go. Uh oh, yo. Ooh. Tahu? I'm looking at that top though. We gotta fix that. Okay. I got some muse. Muse. Okay, we gotta fix the front, kind of. But to be honest, I don't know if I'm gonna do all that. I'm gonna just brush it down. I has it because I don't feel like doing like I got the glue. So I might try to just close your wig without glue. You know, because just pull down a little bit of hairs. Look, like my hair is mixed in with it a tad bit, but. I need to lighten up that part a little bit because it looks like it's red. Yeah. So we're going to lighten up that part. I got this little brush. Let's see. I'm going to use something out of here. I might need to get my other palette. So it could be. Oh, I can't. Mm, I don't like it did nothing. But. I'm gonna get my other palette because this right here is not working. Okay. I got my Christina Dominique palette and I am going to go in with this one right here. It's vanilla cream. Y'all, I love Christina Dominique um, eyeshadow palettes. I love her. She does makeup so good and it's like natural. It's not like it's all the good stuff, you know. Okay. Now let's try this. That's so much better. Y'all see it? It's coming along. Okay. 
Trying to get rid of that red, burgundy looking scalp. Like, but y'all can't really see it that much, but I can. It's coming along really good. Okay. The camera is not picking up real good, but okay. It still look a little red, but I need to get them sides. I see it in the camera. Like, uh, right there. You know. Oh, okay. So let's take this look. So y'all, if you really not a wig wearer like I am, we need to swoop that or something. If you really not a wig wearer, and you just gonna throw something on, I don't know why I didn't keep all my stuff. Why did I forget everything to record a video? My little brush is like in my bathroom. Let me use my finger. And we is going to try to swoop, swoop that with this big old behind brush. And I'm really not an edges person, so. Okay, focus time. Focus. Okay. So it's stuck on my eyelash. So, what y'all think? So I got this mousse. Mousse. Why? I can't even say that. I'm gonna put put this on the curls. So I'm looking the wrong way. So we'll see how that looks. How that do? I guess it. I try to lay it down. I think I'm onto something with these lace closures. Oh shoot. Because they are so cute. It's so easy. Like I love curly hair. Like straight hair. Mm, I feel like they could get after a while they get like a little stiff. Mm, don't want to move. Even though it's good hair. I don't know. I think you can't, you could always revive a curly wig, you know what I'm saying? I keep pulling out my darn earrings. Okay. Yeah, I think this is the final look. Like, yes. Come through hair. And if I want to know what, what uh the link I got this wig from, I'm going to try to find it and link it below because i like just got this wig probably like a month ago and i never wore it because i really don't know why it didn't work so i'm not gonna say so what y'all think i need a little part wait try to put it behind my ear and have like Yeah, this is so cute. Look at that. I mean, you can see that, but who gonna be all in your head? You know what I'm saying? Who gonna be all in your head, girl? Huh? Mm. So, let me turn around for y'all, okay? Turn around. How the back looking? Yeah, it's not really long. It's like. How long is this wig? I think it's like 16 minutes. I think so. So that's... So, what about I say? So that's the end of this video, y'all. I really thought it was going to be like a long video because closure wig, I never, you know, wigs used to take me a long time. Especially like the full lace, which I cannot stay in. But they're so cute. They're so cute. But what y'all think? Okay, okay. Well, thank you for watching this video. 
this is the end i'm just going to end it here because there's nothing else this wig is perfect and went a much it took like less than like okay it took like 10 minutes to put it on all you had to do is put mousse mousse um scissors to cut the lace you know powder swoop a little swoop and that's it y'all so thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed this video and stay tuned don't forget to subscribe to see future videos bye, -bye.